The first thing that you need to do when you arrive at IBC, if you haven't done so already, is to download the app. And James Lakers from IBC, he's here to tell us all about it. So James, what do we need to do? Well, the first thing to remember is when you've downloaded the app, log in with the same email address that you used when you registered for the show. That's really important because it will pull through all of the correct profile information for you and create that really good experience. Okay, and what, what do you think are the best features? I think one of the best features is the interactive floor plan. Um, it's really helpful, you can zoom in and out, search for individual exhibitors and find exactly what you're looking for. So should we go somewhere? Yeah, let's head to the forum lounge. Okay. Let's see if it works. Here we are at the forum. That was great. The map's fantastic. Really, really useful. Yeah. Any other features, James, that you want the, to The key out? one is um, the uh, kind of matchmaking and the uh, networking that you can do through the app. So if you click on attendees at the bottom of the app, you can see all of the attendees and you can filter those by various different categories. So you can look by job title, by country, by organisation size. You can really drill down and find exactly who you want to meet. And on top of that, it will also match make people for you. So there's an AI algorithm in there and it's recommending people that it thinks you want to meet. That's terrific. And you can also um, look at your agenda as well. Is you that can, right? absolutely. So if you click on here on the agenda, you can see all of the sessions. Again, you can filter those by some of the free content that's happening on the show floor and the paid conference. Um, and you can also um, then tag individual sessions into your diary. So if you click on an individual session, you can add that to your schedule and that will come up in my schedule at the top. So useful and not only that you can actually book a taxi through the app and check out all of the restaurants that you can go to too. It's definitely time for a bite to eat so where should we go? Let's head to this one here. Okay.